spent on this trip has turned into like a social butterfly. <laughs> she like doesn't want to hang out with us. It's kind of sad. Ready and there you go. Oh my god! <laughs> I got it. I'm going to vanish the cards from your hand. You ready? Lift up your hand. Oh, oh, what? What? I'm back at the room. I hate life. It's not looking so good. Wake up the boys? Hi, Neymar! Oh, I woke up. Here you go. Oh, where's the ball? Are you sitting on the chair? <laughs> yeah, well, actually, it's not for Harry another Potter hour, trivia. but well, there's a Harry Potter trivia that we're gonna go. Math. If you don't win, you're not no, invited to your birthday party. We can all if I don't win, no, if I don't right. win, I'm not invited to my own party. Okay, okay. we're going to watch. Where is it? Okay, it's downstairs at noon. Oh, oh, yeah. Come on, going. Come on, going. Ice cream in the morning. That's what I'm doing. Holy crap, Nugget. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Am I eating it? Do it. Yeah. Do it. Do it. For number one, how many goalposts are there on a Quidditch pitch? What is used to select competitors for the Tri Resort Tournament? Are there on a Quidditch pitch? Six. Six. Is correct. Got that one right. Mom got number two. Owls. Owls is correct. Number four. Where was That's the ball There's only one that I don't know. Going I'm where right. are we letting all the zoo? Number, two. Two. number five. How many points is the golden snitch worth? Three. Oh, one fifty. Right? <laughs> oh, I'm just getting there. Number seven. What it's number bomb like was the number? That's the number I guess. Really? Stone at Gringotts. 113. That one hundred and thirteen. Seven hundred thirteen. Number eight. Number twelve. I'm 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 panicking right now. <laughs> Cedric the Quarry. Was a member of which house? Hufflepuff. Hufflepuff is correct. Yes. Oh. Only one wrong. Let's see. Nine Nine show of hands. Still got 98%. So that's not losing. That's that's still passing. You just said it. I'm from Townsville, Utah. What is it this time? An elephant. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, it's the same one. Elephant this time. Hey, that's pretty cool. Well, how was the barbecue? We've been waiting for three days for that barbecue. Very good. Worth it? It is so noisy out here. Canyon and Az are on the slides. Lizzie and Savannah are in the teen room looking for the skater boy. And Sarah and I are probably gonna go find some chocolate. Chocolate cake, chocolate. So Johnny was standing there filming the boys and all of a sudden he turns like this, he's like. And it was a lady holding a chocolate cake. <laughs> it was chocolate. It was chocolate. It's the love cake of his life. We better go get some. I don't think it really exists anymore. Uh-oh, we might be in trouble. That's just freezing cold up there. 
playing on the slides in the water. We, I don't know where Canyon is. He must still be up there playing. Anyway, the wind started picking up and we started cruising again. We were set out in the water for quite some time. Anyway, came back to the room so Az could get all uh, tr recharged, get warm, and get uh, get his clothes back on. Um, and now his hoodie. We gotta go find out what everybody else is doing because I feel like it's time to eat, even though I am not hungry. Are you hungry? I feel like time for a cake. I really want cake. I didn't I get really my cake. cake. Anyway, it's been one of those days where it's just kind of hanging out. There's no port to go to. Um, can't really talk to the outside world too much because we don't have service, but uh, it's been good. Now it's time to find everyone. We've eaten so much garbage. Oh, time to go eat more. Savannah decided that for dinner tonight, she wants to wear the jumpsuit that we got in Ensenada yesterday. And it's so cute. I can't wait to show you, but she won't come back here. <laughs> Just kidding, here she comes. So cute. It's actually like, fits me really well. And it has pockets. Okay. It's fine. We'll see you at dinner. Okay, bye, love you. Sven on this trip has turned into like a social butterfly. <laughs> She's meeting all the people and doing all the things. I mean, she always is a social butterfly. But she like doesn't want to hang out with us. It's kind of sad. Sad for us. Oh, you want some? <laughs> Wait, what was it? He did quite a few. I don't know. I couldn't tell. He did like ten. All right, come here. I'll show you. Uh oh. Three. Steve, really Steve wants to try this. Thing. I'm not willing to risk the deliciousness of my meal. All right, chocolate meal. What are you doing? <laughs> How's cakes? It smells uh, like it's not edible. Okay, okay but you put all that. What even do? It's in my food. It helps, like, everyone here helps like, settle your stomach because okay. it's really gassy. Oh, your stomach's upset, right? Nauseated. Oh, your stomach's upset? Yeah. It's weird. It's like... Maybe too many meals. It's probably that. It's a mixture of Is it going to be too strong for my meal? It wasn't okay. so great. It's, it's like chewing gum. Right. Why am I doing this? Because <laughs> the camera's on. It smells good like candy canes. Ready? And there you go. How many are you doing? Are you doing it on your tongue? Taste it with water. The back of your tongue. You kind of weak, I think. I think Branson might have overreacted. No, oh my gosh! I got it. I'm gonna be like breathing candy cane fire. Maybe it's just because I've been doing it for long enough that it's not that big of a deal. So we are sitting at the same table we did last night, same waiter and everything, and he remembered our drink order. He came and brought pineapple drink and club soda. And we didn't even have to ask for a drink or anything. He just knew everybody's drink order. He was So you haven't seen my magic in the last couple of days, right? No. Oh. Really? I'm surprised. You should have perform on every table. I missed it, sorry. <laughs> so I have a deck of cards here, right? Perfect. So what's your name, sir? Branson. Branson. Make sure all the cards are different, right? Can you pull one card for me, please? Pull one out. And have a look at it. Yeah. Oh, I see what Branson's trying to make sure okay. it's not on the side. What? What is it? Okay, okay. Am I supposed to tell him what it is? No, 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 you don't tell me. <laughs> Now, Sorry. tell me how many chances do I get to find the card? Three. Three. Six. Six. Okay. One. No. Here, everyone is a blogger, right? Yeah. I think so. Yeah. <laughs> so watch the three of us. I have. So how close am I with this card? Pretty close. Yeah. Can, I, can I have your hand? So I take the three of us. Put it over here. Place your other hand on top of this. Perfect. So I'm all scared. I have to do is actually take one card, just like that. Have a look at it, sir. No. No. What? what? Now watch this. Watch the hand of my right. Was that the hand pack? Show me hand again, sir. Place the other hand on top of this. Ready? I'll take one card. I'm freaked out right I'll now. Take one more card. <laughs> oh, that's your card. You know what I'm going? To, what's your name? Ty. Ty. I'm going to vanish the cards from your hand. You ready? One, two, three. The entire deck is disappeared from your hand, sir. Lift up your hand and see it. Lift up your hand. Oh, oh, what? What? <laughs> Ty, are you in on this? <laughs> <laughs> Can I show you one more trick? Yeah, yes. absolutely. 
Yeah. Yeah. Rubik's Cube. Alright, yeah. so let's try something fun. So how many of you know how to solve a Rubik's Cube? Nobody? Nobody. It's alright. Nobody knows how to solve one. No. Oh, I'm sure I'm Here is the game, okay? So I'm just gonna mix the Rubik's Cube like this. Ready? This now, imagine, okay? Imagine. Watch this, okay? Now, I take the cube like this. Now, imagine this Rubik's Cube is actually gonna get solved in 30 moves away. Imagine it's gonna get actually get solved in 10 moves away. Imagine in one move, if you really imagine it actually, in one move it's solved. <gasps> what? It doesn't make any sense and some of you might be thinking that I was flipping it around or I had a switch or button on it, you know, I switched the cube, something you are thinking, I know. So a magician never repeats a trick, so I'm going to do it for you one last time. Watch this. I'm scared. <laughs> Does he have all of our wallets? Watch the cube, ready? And see this, this is the scenario, you know, sometimes when magic is surrounded, right, it's hard to, you know, impress because some people will catch it. So everyone is surrounded, you are looking from this side, back side, you know, afraid. I don't... It's okay, what's the cube? Ready? I take the cube like this and actually shake it up. What the heck? What the heck? So, like, yeah, one last thing, alright? Can you pull one card out, sir? Yeah, you take it up, take it up. Have a look at it. Remember it. Alright? Perfect. Now cover it up, cover the card up. Let's make this fair, okay? This time I'm gonna make it the most fairest way as possible. Can you hold the deck for me? Put the card anywhere in the middle of the card. Anywhere you want. Now that's fair, right? Yeah. 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 That's fair. That's fair. Now mix them up. Oh. Guys, <laughs> 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 Where's my wallet? I'm really sorry. Oh, it's concerned. It's going, it's going. Man. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. So, do you want me to find the card the easy way or the hard way? Hard way. Hard, hard, hard way. way. Yeah. So watch, watch the cards, all right? You can see all of the cards, right? So, here is the idea. Idea is to actually shuffle up the cards like this. Put it over here. Take your hand. Can I, can I, have, I use your index finger? You put it in the middle and you shuffle it, right? Even I don't know, you don't know, and I don't know which card you took, but you don't know which where it is, right? Yeah. Please don't pick the right card. <laughs> No! What? what? <laughs> How did you do that? <laughs> Man, you have such a magical fingers. <laughs> That's crazy. Thank you so much. I'll give you him my ID, you know, I'll give you my ID. There's the guy's, what is it, Instagram? Yeah, I need to see it. Okay, check him out right there. Back to Camp Ocean. Alright, you got your ice cream and your pizza. Remember earlier how I was saying, eat, we're going to eat again, we're going to eat again, we're going to eat again. Well, I've overdone it. I've definitely overdone it. Sarah went up for ice cream, trying to get the kids, and I think they're grabbing pizza right now. Well, I'm back at the room. I hate my life. In fact, I think I'm just going to lay down. I'm so full and not feeling well at all. And so, I think I'm going to lay down. It's not good, guys. It's not good. Take my Miralax, lay down, and hopefully I'll be okay tomorrow. It's not looking so good right now, though. Okay, so I'm going to be really quiet, but I just made it back to my room. Um, it's like almost 3 o'clock in the morning. We, me and Lizzie stayed up hanging out with our friends just in the hallways and just talking. Um, we made a lot of fun friends and definitely gonna miss them. We're gonna talk to them, stay in touch, but made lots of friends, had lots of fun, had such a fun cruise. It was just such a fun experience. I'm in the bathroom right now because Danielle and Ty are asleep, so I have to be in here so that, that there's light, but um, made so many new friends, had so much fun. It was just such a fun, amazing time and we all just bonded and spent time with each other and we're just all ourselves and it was so fun. So thank you guys for coming on the cruise with us. 
love you guys so much as always you're worth it bye guys bye.